Just their height to make sure that the uh, seat post clamp isn't isn't going down onto the unnecessarily onto the frame or or, or hitting the saddle. Yeah. Um, we can also um, move the uh, this this part back if we need to adjust the, the setting. So we typically unclamp the, the oh the, that's cool. We unclamp it. We put the the wheel here. We then clamp it. Uh, then it goes into the into the starter's hand. So uh, while it's all cabled uh, at the uh, timing results area. Uh, John Nicholson will start the uh, the countdown clock uh, yeah. that you see here on the left. Yeah. Uh, that board uh, will, will there will be a beep at ten, yeah. and then one every five seconds. The gates will automatically open. The time will start, and the the rider departs. Before the um, the rider gets on, uh, you put pressure on the on the low side so the rider comes from the top. I'll stand here high side, yep. uh, and then yeah, I'll I'll just get it off the track before they come around again. So Hugo, you're the other commentator here today. Absolutely. Pretty good commentator, I must say. How old are you? Uh, 18 years old. Been doing Mate, I reckon you're going to be one of the stars in the future. Well, country. hopefully. It's a bit of, yeah, it's good fun. I've been doing it for about three years now. Started out with the National Junior Track Series, the Max Stevens. This is my first time commentating with Noel Sands, a bit of the yeah. big, one of the big guns of the uh, country cycling circuit, from what I've heard. He's a bit of a hero, isn't yeah, he? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. You, are you the next Matt Keenan? Uh, maybe. He's one, he's one of my heroes. So. Is he, is he, uh, is he, have you been talking to him about? Yeah, I've commentated with him uh, before, actually, and I keep in contact with him. So, yeah, yeah no, nah, really good bloke. Yeah, get on well with him. <laughs> Noel, welcome back to the blog, mate. Thanks, Mark. Good it's to really see you good, again. Good to have you back. Mate, um, what's happening here today? Well, it's a big day. A young lady called Anna Davis, we'll call her a young lady, is going for the world hour record. She's in the division um, 50 to 54 for women, yeah. and she's the current holder of the world hour record. Last time she rode 43.206 kilometres an hour on this track yeah. in 2017, and today she's going to smash it to pieces. You confident? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Did you get sleep last night? I slept remarkably well. Did you? Yes. Wow, I would have slept for about an hour. That's, That's the beauty of doing it the second time. On ya. Yeah. All right, well, good luck. We're all rooting for you. Thank you very much. And if anybody's interested, she's riding a 104 inch gear, which is absolutely humongous. And her cut revs today are going to be 92 to 93 revs per minute. That's a big gear. It's a stat. Whew. I wouldn't like to push <laughs> 104, but anyway, Anna will, I'm sure. This lady is very good, a fastidious trainer. She would have prepared for this 104 inch gear for a long time. And she's off. Sorry, Anna, we'll have to restart the, uh, the timing did not start, so apologies to everybody, especially Anna, hopefully this won't affect her nerves. So. No, she's getting tired. Is she? She's tired. A sore arm. Oh, she's slowing down a bit. Right. You got four minutes. Amazing, 44.4k an hour average unofficial at the moment. The old world record 43.2, so what an effort that was. Oh, Scott, won't put her on the bike yet. She'll be too tired, but what an amazing achievement today. We witnessed this to be made. All right, you're all right. Um, it, the speed of each lap in kilometres an hour, yeah. and you can see here, it's just a, a constant decrease throughout the hour. Yeah, last year. If we look at this year's, um, you've got 44 k an hour here. She just picks up to it and Nip drops under it. Set and forget, mate. That's pretty amazing. Set and forget. Just better than expected? Much better. Really? I feel like I was cruising for 30 minutes. You're kidding. And so then how the, what about the false start? Yeah. How'd that, that make a, you feel? It took a bit of a toll. 
you waste a lot of energy on that first start and I don't think the second one was quite up to par but I uh, settled down pretty quickly within five minutes I was very comfortable and yep. stayed comfortable right up till about the last 15 to go. So cool. That's yeah. pretty amazing. That's really cool. Go James. Same complication that Anna Davis found in her attempt. Fortunately, hasn't quite realised, but it's it's on. Restart this one. Hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Absolutely, you can't use my word. I'll use <laughs> other words. <laughs> well, we've got What's a problem happening? with the starting gate. I think it's the tape they roll across the tape to actually start it. It won't trip the um, the bike leaving, so I don't know what's happening. It's happened twice today, so yeah. hopefully they can fix it up. Come on, mate. Go, 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 go. Okay, it's work. So the current world record is held by Robert Scarlett at 48.8 kilometres. James is going for 50k, so if he can get 50, he's got the world record wrapped up. At the current point in time, he is 20 minutes into his ride, so he's got 40 minutes to go. He's just got to fight to keep it above 50. That's all. He'll be happy with that. I think he'll hate to see 49, but he'll... Uh so slow to he was below 18. He was yeah 179 was sort of the target but <laughs> lots of things happen man. You do it in training and he would have been doing 177s heaps in training. Yeah. And then it's just nerves and conditions and all sorts of things on the day it all adds up. Yeah. You gotta be able to handle everything. So. Yeah. Section. I wasn't sure his, his lap splits were kind of just tailing off a bit. But I think he finds something. Yeah, he put his he put his hands up on the top of the bars. He got very concerned at that stage, but he's still about 700 metres up on the record. I think he can bring this one hope and do it. But I think the legs are starting to give up on him a little bit. He went yeah. out pretty hard in those first 15. Yeah. Starting to tail off, but I reckon he's got enough in the tank to bring this one home. It's 196, getting closer. 196 laps means he's going to do 49 kilometres. That's what he needs for the record. Come on, James. Pushing you around a bit. He's really trying to get everything out of his machine now. That is fantastic. Yeah, he had to he had to dig. Sorry, my voice is gone, but he had to dig. He looked he looked like he hit the wall with about 18 minutes to go. He, he dug in somewhere. He's, he's pulled it out. How is he doing? That's, that is fantastic. Some reserve, some mental resilience. Uh, it'll be good to have a chat with him after this and, and see where it goes. It's fantastic. You lean the bike down. Yep. Yeah. I should have bought the pickle juice, I didn't even think of it. Good buddy. We haven't had cramp once in 20 weeks of training. 
and then today just a savage cramp originally in my left calf went over there and then with about 20 minutes Specific? 49.5. Would you have liked to have cracked it up over 50? Oh, definitely. I'd like to have gone over 51, but happy to get the record. It's a t it was a tough day, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Tough day, slow day. Um, and some things you can do as much training as you want, but you don't know what's going to happen on the day. Yeah. Um, like you never know the false start or who knows what. Yeah. Um, but you just got to deal with what comes up. You just got to so, deal with it, don't you? It's all good. No, that's good, mate. No, sir. Thanks for coming out. Is it user error, do we think? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> I can't comment. Someone will give me a cup, possibly. Hey, how, possibly hey, how, nervous, is, how nervous is Stephen Lane? Yeah, Stephen Lane is absolutely... Oh, he's just... Look at him there. over there. He's just like... Oh, so funny.